Hello, and welcome back to Holistic Healing Hacks. What if I told you the secret to living past 100 isn't a miracle pill? It's hiding in your gut. Scientists just discovered four specific bacteria that supercentenarians, people who live to 110 and beyond, have in abundance. And today, I'll reveal exactly how to grow them naturally. Now here's a bonus tip. If you're someone who's struggling to lose weight, no matter how hard you try, then listen out for number two. It could be the solution to your problem. Now, does any of this sound familiar to you? No matter how much you sleep, you wake up after eight hours of sleep, but you're still exhausted. Coffee becomes a crutch, naps don't help, and by 3 p.m., you're crashing hard. This isn't normal tiredness. It's your gut bacteria screaming for help. What about brain fog or mood swings? You walk into a room and forget why you're there. Your focus is shot and your mood swings like a pendulum. Happy one minute, irritable the next. Surprise! Did you know your gut makes 90% of your serotonin, the happy hormone? When bad gut bacteria dominate, they pump out toxins that cloud your brain and trigger anxiety and depression. Weak immunity, always catching colds, you're always the first to get sick. A coworker sneezes and bam, you're down for a week. Cuts take forever to heal and you're constantly fighting off infections. Here's why. 70% of your immune system lives in your gut. Achy joints or slow recovery, your knees creak like a rusty door hinge, and after a workout, you're sore for five days straight. Most blamaging? But the truth is, it can actually be caused by gut inflammation. Did you know bad bacteria leak toxins into your blood? Attacking your joints, causing you uncomfortable aches and pains? Your gut microbiome might be screaming for these four longevity bacteria. And here's the scary part. Most people's diets kill them off without even realizing it. A groundbreaking 2023 study from Italy analyzed the gut microbiomes of people aged 20 to 115. They found four standout bacteria in centenarians, people who are 100 years old or more, that were nearly absent in younger, sicker populations. Okay, but enough of that. Before I give you the foods, these four specific bacteria that can be found in those supercentenarians, people who live to 110 or more, have in abundance. Here is the list of bacteria. Number one, Ackermansia mucinifera. This mucus-loving bacterium acts like your gut's inner repair crew. It actually thickens your intestinal lining, sealing leaks that cause inflammation. Think of it as your body's natural duct tape, linked to weight loss, cancer reversal, and gut lining repair. Number 2. Cristincinella minuta, nicknamed the skinny bacteria. It's a rare microbe, so powerful that when scientists transplanted it into obese mice, they lost weight without dieting. Your gut's metabolic secret weapon. Rare, but it lowers inflammation and cholesterol. Number 3. Oscillobacter. This mysterious bacterium works night shifts in your gut. It produces compounds that calm your nervous system while you sleep. Missing it? That's when tired but wired syndrome kicks in, boosts metabolism and brain health. And lastly, number four, Odorobacter. Now don't let the name fool you. This stink named bacterium is your brain's best friend. It digests fiber into compounds that cross into your brain, acting like natural antidepressants, protects against dementia and heart disease. These bacteria don't just help you live longer, they keep your mind sharp, energy high, and body disease free. Now if you're thinking, okay, but how do I actually check if my gut is missing these longevity bacteria? I've got you covered. I'm giving away a free gut health checklist that walks you through. Grab it right now in the description below. It will only take two seconds, and it's my gift to you for caring about your long-term health. Now here's how to naturally cultivate these longevity bacteria. No expensive supplements needed. Eat more of these food and your gut will thank you. For Ackermansia. So how do you feed Ackermansia? It's all about elagitanins. These weirdly named compounds can actually be found in pomegranates. So stock up. Pomegranates contain these powerful compounds called elagitanins. They're like fertilizer for your Ackermansia bacteria. When you eat them, your gut converts them into postbiotics. 
Think of these as bacteria superfoods that help acromantia thrive. No elegitanins? Your gut's repair crew goes on strike. That spicy kick in chili peppers? It's capsaicin, a compound that literally tricks your gut into thinking it's under attack. This mild stress triggers a survival response, forcing your gut to recruit more acromantia soldiers to fortify your intestinal walls. No spice? Your gut's defense team gets lazy. Here's something that might surprise you. Cooled potatoes, green bananas. When you cook then cool potatoes or eat green bananas, their starch morphs into resistant starch, a fancy term for bacteria buffet. This starch survives digestion, reaching your gut intact where acromantia devours it like rocket fuel, multiplying faster. Heat it up again, the buffet closes, so eat them cold. For Kristen Sinella, consider incorporating fermented foods like kimchi and sauerkraut into your diet. Additionally, polyphenol-rich berries such as black raspberries and blueberries can be beneficial. To cultivate Oscillobacter, leafy greens like kale and spinach are great choices. Also, omega-3 sources such as wild salmon and flax seeds can support its growth. For Odorobacter, prebiotic fibers found in garlic, onions, and asparagus are key. And don't forget, Green tea, particularly its EGCG content, can significantly boost growth. Green tea's secret weapon, EGCG, isn't just for weight loss, it's a gut ninja. It sneaks into your colon and tricks harmful bacteria into self-destructing, freeing up space for Odorobacter to grow. More Odorobacter equals sign more brain-boosting compounds hitting your bloodstream. Now here's a list of things that, well, will slowly kill your gut health. Try to avoid these as best as possible because, honestly, they destroy these beneficial bacteria. Artificial sweeteners like sucralose wipe out acromantia. Antibiotics, unless absolutely necessary, should be avoided. And processed seed oils? They cause gut inflammation. So steer clear of these if you can. Did you know? A 2024 UCLA study took 70-year-olds with low levels of these bacteria and put them on a gut-friendly diet for six months. The results? Their microbiome started resembling a person of 30-year-olds. Less inflammation, better memory, and even reversed biological age markers. This isn't science fiction, it's your body's hidden ability to heal when you feed it right. Don't forget to grab your free gut health checklist in the description below. Your gut is your second brain. Feed it well, and it'll reward you with decades of vibrant health. If you're ready to transform your gut health in just 30 days, I've created something special for you, my anti-inflammatory meal plan. If you're sick of patching up symptoms like leaky gut, weak immunity, and chronic fatigue, it's time to fix the root cause. My anti-inflammatory recipe pack isn't just meals, it's your 30-day repair kit. Silence chronic inflammation with meals that taste too good to be healing and reset your energy, digestion, and immunity with zero guesswork. Grab yours in the description below. Let me know in the comments if you're suffering or have suffered from any gut health issues and what you did to help improve it. I hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. Take care and I'll see you in the next video. Follow for more holistic healing hacks.